my name is Tom. I uh, joined the Army in 1970 and uh, went to Vietnam for nine months. At first, when I, when I got out, I, uh, I came home and, you know, it, was, it just felt weird. Like, you didn't belong here, you belonged over there or something, I don't know. But I think it could be because of the adjustment. Because American society is different than over there, you know, it's a whole cultural difference. I became, uh, I, was kinda, I wouldn't say kind of depressed, it was just like, geez, I didn't know what I wanted to do. My dad said, well, just go get a job. You know, I quit and got fired at all these jobs. And I actually, sometimes I actually did it on purpose, and it was, it was hell, because I had to go get another job. You're happy to go to work every day. And then after about five or six months, sometimes you just uh, say to yourself, God, I'm tired of coming in here. What I found out eventually later on, as I look back, I had like, I was like uh, manic depressant or bipolar in my, it runs in my family. But it, it, even when I was married, I thought, well, geez, I don't think I got it. But I was in and out of so many jobs. I said, this is crazy. It was terrible. When you're a, like a manic, you get like really excited. And then there's times where you get really depressed. Like it's like going to a party. And once the party's over, you crash and it's a it's a bad crash. But your life is like that all the time. Sometimes you could you could have a happy day, like get out and get up in the morning and all suddenly two hours later you could say, Oh geez, I'm getting depressed. It just enters your head and say, You're not gonna be happy today. I was going to counseling way back. I had a private counselor, I don't know, it was through medical insurance. But I never thought about going to the VA. And so the first time I went there, I think, I don't, even, I don't think I had an appointment, I just went in. And they fit me in someplace to talk to somebody and then they scheduled me. I went to the, the counselor a few times and uh, talked to them. and. At first, I, at first I went, I just told him, I says, you know, I said, this is crazy. I've been in a dozen jobs and I'm tired of quitting. They help you out. I, 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 I have no complaints about it. I had somebody to go to, to talk to. I think I have a more positive attitude about things than I did. It used to be negative. Mentally, I think uh, my head's a lot more clear now than it was. If I had to go back and redo it, I probably would have went to the VA earlier when I was like 20 some years old instead of when I was 50. And uh, that's the trouble with a lot of people. If you think your life is not going too well, I think you should get yourself some help. I should, I should realize that my wife, my wife might have said something, but you know, it's mental illness is like a denial. The VA will help you out.